about the Blockchain for Humanity Awards. Well, innovative technologies are not themselves sufficient to transform the development landscape in places where they need it most. They need to be sustained by innovative business models that are rooted at the respective social context. It is important that entrepreneurs are close to the problem they're trying to solve. The awards are meant to stimulate socially responsible businesses so that they can offer more than just benefits to a selected group of shareholders. We believe in the new way of entrepreneurs and business leaders that are challenging the traditional extractive ways of cooperation approach that is mostly aligned with the maximization of quarterly returns. This new generation of entrepreneurs go beyond just creating sustainable businesses. They create purpose-driven organizations. These organizations are there to pursue grassroots social and environmental values above extracting circular currency from the economy and transferring into profit. We believe in social innovation creating prosperity, not just alleviating poverty. The Blockchain for Humanities at War are a way to identify and recognize such initiatives. It shows us the effect of the market creating, behavior changing, and culture forming innovation economic development models. We take pride in working closely with inspiring entrepreneurs who want to make a difference in the world. We have received over 100 applications and the Berkshire for Humanity Health World have recognized 18 outstanding projects. The applications increase year over year, 30% from uh, 2017 to 18 and 50% from 2018 to 2019. This is really exciting for us. We know that this positive upward trend is taking us to the place where we want to go, the usage of the technology for social impact. One remarkable data point revealed from the assessment of all applications is that the top three categories are equally distributed, and they are financial inclusion, social integration, which includes digital identity, and social economic inclusion. This last one has seen an increase from 17% during the early years to 30% just 2019. The numbers inspire us. We can see how we're moving from ideas and concepts to really impactful business models that have already proven our point, that are already on pilot, or that are full products. The Blockchain for Humanity Awards have two categories, the dreamers and the shapers. Very early on, we decided that it wasn't fair for everyone to be judged or evaluated under the same criteria. So the Dreamers Award are for those initiatives that have a very high potential, a good use case, a justifiable use of the technology, but they're still at an early stage. These Dreamers are considered the projects that will qualify for the Catalyzer program. Under this Catalyzer program, they will receive the full support of Blockchain for Humanity and its ecosystem of partners and mentors. And of course, they start uh, being part of the Coalition for Good Movement. On the other side, there are the Shapers Awards. And these are initiatives that have already demonstrated a strong use case with uh, solutions that address a social and environmental gap and has demonstrated alignment with the sustainable development goals. These projects are more mature, they are on a growth mode, and they serve as models for the dreamers. The shapers category is viewed beyond the Catalyzers program goals. However, they can benefit from brand awareness, media coverage, use case promotion, and invitations to industry conferences where they can have the opportunity to increase visibility and exposure to the rest of the ecosystem. What happens after the B4H Awards? Well, the recipients of the Dreamers Awards go through the initiation of the Catalyzer program, which means a full review of the project with multiple strategy sessions with the founding team to assess concept, use case, uh, validation, technical application, architectural, business model, product market fit, and so on. We work towards ensuring there is a viable, commercially sound, 
and sustainable business model. These are not philanthropic or uh, non-profit initiatives. We do encourage that these initiatives need to be sustainable and therefore commercially sound. The work done through the program is carried out by the Blockchain for Humanity core team in support of the relevant mentors in our ecosystem. We are good also at connecting the dots to leverage the spirit of open source and collaboration. We know that for large scale transformation, we need everyone involved. We can't do this alone. Social innovation needs synergy and collaboration. This is it. We need to join forces if we want to make something.